guys, welcome to my channel. If you are new here, I would love if you subscribed. Don't forget to click the notification bell so you get notified of my new uploads because 80% of you, very strangely, watch my videos but aren't subscribed. It'll take two seconds and it'll really help me out. And while you're there, if you can click the thumbs up, job is a good one, my day is made. But the reason you clicked on today's video is so you can see me style wide leg jeans 10 ways. Now I have a pair of wide leg jeans from Monkey. They're in a beautiful light wash, which I think is perfect for summer. They remind me of Levi's, they have a vintage vibe. I just love light wash denim through and through. I think it goes with everything. So I've done 10 ways to wear wide leg jeans from casual to dressy. Also, the outfits are interchangeable with the weather because here in the UK, the summer weather is unpredictable. It's warm one day and it's raining the next so I've tried to do a range of outfits to cover all weather conditions so let's just get into my 10 ways to wear wide leg jeans all the items I've pulled are existing in my wardrobe and I will leave them everything linked in the description box down below if there's anything you like now let's get into the styling for the first outfit styling wide leg jeans I have styled my favorite way to wear a white shirt wearing it quite loose and then I like to tie it in a knot at the front. Thought I'd go for a bit of a dressy look with this one so I've paired it with some white heels to complement the white top and then I've paired with that the perfect summer bag, my cute raffia LMA bag but of course any raffia or straw bag would recreate the look perfectly. For my second outfit, styling wide leg jeans, I've gone for a more casual vibe. This is great to throw on when you're running errands or nipping to the shops. So I've popped on a knitted vest and also a knitted long cardigan from I Saw It First. Both super comfortable and really affordable. Then for my shoes, I've gone for some flats. These are also from Monkey, the same place as my wide leg denim jeans. And then I finished that off with my Senrev Midi Maestra bag. Just a great all rounder bag that you can use day to day and wear lots of different ways as a backpack over the shoulder. So it's really versatile and it really is worth the money in my opinion. So I think this third look might actually be my favourite. So styling the wide leg jeans, I have popped on a one shouldered bodysuit from Misguided, but I love the fact I have paired this with my Converse. I've got the CDG Converse, but any Converse would do. And I love how this emulates a very 70s vibe, very casual, very but very chic, very far a faucet, I think I would say. And then I paired with that my Balenciaga mini city bag. And if it's a little bit chilly, just pop over a leather jacket or a blazer with this one. Outfit for styling wide leg jeans. I've gone again for something a little bit more dressy, but also casual. So I would wear this out for drinks. And again, if it gets a little bit nippy, throw a blazer over the top. But I've just gone for a new top I picked up in the Topshop sale. I will leave that whole linked if you missed it. I've gone for some toe post mules, really low heel, really comfortable, easy to walk in. And then my I saw it first Bottega dupe handbag. Outfit five is again a casual look, just an easy way to wear jeans and a t-shirt in summer. So I've popped on a really oversized t-shirt and a trick to kind of make it look a little bit more fitted in the front is to tuck it into your bra and it's best to be wearing an underwide bra for this. Then I've paired it with my Birkenstock. Again, I have a video on my Birkenstock sandals I will leave linked and finished off again with my LMA raffia bag. Just a really easy throw on, casual, chic, minimal outfit. Seeing as though I've been talking about blazers, I thought I would style a look with the wide leg jeans with a kind of crop top and then also a blazer over the top. So here I have a Zara rib knit cami with my new monkey blazer. I'm so obsessed with this, but you all know that I love an oversized dad blazer. I have another pair of toe post mules, but again, but this time they are a nude pair and I think they really elongate the leg. Finished off with my I Saw It First Bottega dupe clutch bag. Outfit number seven, styling my wide leg jeans. Something a little bit different. I've actually been loving wearing a hat lately. Still not sure whether I suit them, so let me know in the comments below. But I've styled again with a shirt, this time a silk shirt. I also like to leave it quite unbuttoned, but tuck it in. I think it gives a really nice kind of sexy silhouette, especially if it's an evening outfit. But if it's a day and you feel self-conscious, of course, just do a few more buttons up. I paired it again with some toe post mules. Can you tell I'm loving toe post mules? And then I popped on my hat, which is an old one from Topshop. Really want a lack of colour hat, but 
it's an investment and I still don't know whether I suit them or not. <laughs> and then I finished that off with my Balenciaga mini city bag again, just to bring all the blacks together with the light wash denim jeans. Outfit number eight, styling wide leg jeans, is giving you all of the dad vibes. It's a little bit Scandi inspired as well. And I've popped on a Topshop oversized poplin shirt with my monkey light wash denim jeans. And then I've gone for the dad trainer, which is the runner trainer. I have a pair here from Nike. And it's just, again, a really easy, effortless outfit to throw on. And as always, I like to do something with my shirt. And I also am a little bit of a fan of one side in and one side out and I would probably actually roll the sleeves up on this one, I forgot to do it in the video. Styling wide leg jeans, outfit number nine, features my favourite t-shirt of the moment, which is a sleeveless padded top, mine is from Mango, and I've gone for an oversized vibe with mine. So I've tucked it in the jeans, I've belted it to emphasise the waist with my beautiful Decorian belt, which I have a video on styling, so I'll leave that linked as well. And again, I have the toe post mules on again, told you I was a fan and then my little Prada bag to finish it off because I thought I would probably wear this out for drinks. It's casual but you can make it look a little bit more dressy with your um, accessories. Outfit number 10, we are at the end of my wide leg styling jeans video and I've gone for an outfit to reflect the rainy weather in the UK. So I've popped on a plain t-shirt with my beautiful trench coat from a brand called Saint and Sophia. I've popped on a pair of flats just to show you how you can also wear these jeans with kind of loafers or pumps. And then again, my very versatile Senrev Midi Maestro bag. And that is the final look from me. I had so much fun filming a video like this. It's been a while since I've kind of done a more outfit based video with lots of different outfits. And I've started doing 10 ways to wear over on my Instagram at Charlotte Buttrick. If you wanna go and follow me there, I post daily. You'll also see more 10 ways to wear and a little bit more outfit inspiration than you will get here on my YouTube channel. But I hope you've enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think of the wide leg jeans looks. If you want me to do another 10 ways to wear with a different wardrobe, item let me know in the comments below and i can 100 percent do that i hope you're all really well and thank you so much for watching it does really mean so much to me because i love filming and i love my little family here on youtube so i will see you guys for my next video bye guys